going to talk about something scary, a thunderstorm on the beach. That scares me more than going into a bad neighborhood or anything of that sort. Thunderstorm on the beach. Um, I'm laying down. Wow.
fast as storms rolling up over us. Un movimiento de madre para que tú sepas. Wow. Uh. Oye, lo que viene es candela. Oye, corre, que viene tremendo aire, viento, agua, viento para todo el mundo. Corre, a hacer. No corre. Oye, pero lo que viene es tremendo viento, a hacer. Tremendo agua. Tremendo viento, a hacer. Lo que viene es candela para que tú. Oye, pero corre. Eso es un, un tornado a cero, oye, tremendo viento para que tú sepas. Un tornado para que tú sepas. Oye, tremendo viento. Oye, pero que viene escandela a cero. ¿Tú estás viendo eso a cero? ¿Tú, ¿Tú estás viendo un clase de viento a cero? Oye, tremendo viento a cero. Te va a llevar la silla, oye, amarra la silla a cero. Oye, pero se te va a ir volando la silla para que tú sepas. Oye, amarra la silla a cero. ¿Qué te va? Amarra la silla, Cere. Oye, amarra la silla. Wow. Dude, this is a storm of proportions. <laughs> it's coming. Yeah, it's coming, guys. Whew. Wow. This turned into a wicked storm out of nowhere. Tremendo aguacero para que tú sepas. Oye, hacer es ramba, boluya, viento, hacer.
Aguacero, un aguacero de madre, para que tú sepas. This is one of my favorite things about Florida, afternoon showers. It's just incredible, man. I love it. You know, just to sit back and drink some tea or something and watch this crap unfold. Wind, rain, thunder. Man, I love these thunderstorms. This is what Tampa Bay does though. metal detect on the beaches but it turns out that rain down there and started raining all over the place. That lady's walking right down the road like that. You're gonna get pneumonia down there. Now tell you what, you gonna start the thunderstorm down there. It's start raining down there, tell you what. Gotta love this man. Not raining down there. I tell you. Getting off this island down there too man. I'm trying to tell That's you. the beautiful thing about Florida. You don't even need an idea of what you're doing. You just go out there. Something's going to happen. That's all we know in Florida. You don't need to plan it out or nothing. You can just go. You go. You don't need to plan it out or what are we doing or are we, are we going to. But we don't matter. You just go out there and something's going to happen. Believe me. Something will happen. You don't need to plan it out or. Or, you know, make a plan or what do we do in a day? None of that crap. Just get out there and something will happen to you, man. I'm trying to tell you. I don't know why there's cones on the road. Because there's a stop sign. Of course, nobody's stopping for it because it's Florida. And it got blown over now. It's just standing out there in the middle of rain like that. I'll tell you what, it's going to rain like that. Get that water and put that in there. Just put that water plug down in that thing. You're just... Put some WD-40 on that and watch the whole thing just come off of corrosion like that. And then there's a thunderstorm the other day. We was out there on the beach and kind of taped and started rain pouring down there. You're going to get them kids sick in the back of that thing right there. It's flooded too. It's flooded down there. You just, I don't even know if I can drive my camera, dude. I need to get a Ford 500 down there. I can't be driving my camera to this rain down there. I'm trying to tell you, you just get a little big old... 2500 down there, 6.0 on that thing, and it's just going five, six miles to the gallon. That's the problem with that truck. That's why I don't have it no more. I had that 2500 down there, you just five, six, four, three miles to the gallon down there. You put a trailer behind that thing or something every day, but it, and you're just going to the beach down there, scallywagging or that thing, squatting nader down there. You're just going to realize they got two, two, four, five miles to the gallon of that thing. You need a whole dang water pump filtration system just to get the dang gas pump filled up on that thing. You dang circle 11 down there, get you familiar with that gas pump down there. I tell you what, man, it's windier than a mug up in the joint. You feel like you're gonna fly up off this bridge right here. 
I'll, I'll wait until the rain come down. You can come off this bridge, 50, 60 mile per hour winds on this thing. You might just come off there flying on that truck. But that's why I waited me about four to five good 20, 30 minutes on that bridge down there. Whole thing's aluminum until you get caught up on that electric fire thing wind down there and whatnot. Next thing you know, you're flying off in the dang thunderstorm. Didn't even know what killed you. You just get chocker fire down there. Next thing you don't burn that burnt that fire twister down there. Like a dang spark plug. You just blow up down there kind of thing. And that's why I tell you, you don't just wait a little bit, wait for that thunderstorm to pass. Next thing you know, you fry like a chicken fry pie down there. I'm trying to tell you, man. I'm blind like a mug, dude. I ain't supposed to be riding to this rain like here. I can't see a dang thing with a dang thing down there. I'm trying to tell you. I don't even know where the crap is <coughs> going or nothing like that. And then on the way over here, it smelled like a dang fire truck or something was burning down there. You just dang old, that's not even legal in Florida. You're not even supposed to be doing that. You, then you down there, put your window down the way to the beach. You don't even got to buy nothing. You just put your dang window down and smell that pipe, pipe fireplace down there or something with that chimney pipe or something. And then next thing you know, they'll try to tell you like, oh, move to Florida, that's safe down here. To that. That's not even legal in Florida. And they're burning it like it's a dang Fire Easter chimney pipe or something down there. It's not even, now you're supposed to be doing that along here. And then next thing you know, there's homeless people sleeping on the benches by the beach. I paid too much money for this crap. And then I had to drive to Bradenton to get out here. Four to five minutes. From Lakewood Ranch down to this beach town over here. It's been 45 minutes. Just bumper to bumper in that dang crackhead talking about, Come on, man, get my daughter, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. I'm just trying to tell you, man, get a job or something down there. I tell you what, you drive to that burning tent, just my, meth pipe crackville down there. And that trailer park, that, <coughs> tell you what, that pick town, pick town, trailer park down there it's nothing but a bunch of junkies down there i drove by that there were 520 junkies on the ground i said what type of moonshine feeling feather down there it's just laying down on the ground with that pipe need to get a dang job down there that wendy's down there they're gonna open that dang with that firehouse sub down there uh, dang dang old brand new restaurant down there with the doubt taco down there to give people diarrhea for ten dollars an hour or something because i can't sit out here watching all these folks we ain't got no job. They're just sitting there smoking that crack thing or hit that rock or something down there with that M30 or something down there with them pipe needles and stuff. You know, they don't just ain't got to drive through all that just to get a dang pizza out here in Branton. I tell you what, you get on that intersection down there, it look like dang old zombie apocalypse or something just coming up out of that circle. Okay, I'm trying to tell you, man. I'm trying to tell you what, dang old zombie apocalypse or something coming out there like Sir okay, look like a look like a dang mommy or something down there thinking about like thing old mumbai india or something behind that circle okay i'm trying to tell you man and you can tell them folks like tell you what like man got no money man just got they're like man you got rims on that truck though i seen them i said i pay for that thing old with that dang work down there you could think ask me for dang dang monster two four dollars and then they're drinking a monster too man and up four dollars for seven dollars for two monsters down there like you need energy to sit out there in that pipe all day. You don't need no dang monster. You need dang electrolyte water or something down there. Never seen a crackhead buying no electrolyte water by that circle game. You see them get that monster like they're going to work or something. I mean, ain't going to no work. You don't need no dang monster down there. You need a dang, dang job down there to tell you, man. I ain't been out there buying Gatorades and monsters like they're out there about to go go weight bench lifting or something. They ain't going to live nothing but them pipe down there. I'm trying to tell you, man. I, I'm, I'm a done frustrated as go and get with them people down there. They talk about give me my dollar, man. Tell you what, give me nigga rent down the first of the month. Better have that rent money down there. I tell you what, they don't catch me down there crackling with them things. And it's just Bradenton's just wrong, man. I'm just trying to tell you, like you come out here that Bradenton down there. Talk about where's this pizza place we ordered from? I don't even know where the crap it's at. I usually just use crackheads for reference points but since it's ran they're not out today and i don't know where the crap they went most of the time just come out here and get a pizza from this Italian place down there take that home talk about man you're not supposed to be eating no pizza's not helpful for you at least i ain't on that pipe down there i tell you what that'll really mess you up
I'm trying to tell you, man, dang storm. I'm trying to tell you that dang storm surge wind down there came blowing trees down and dang storm down there came through that wind and everything. Dang old wind storm raining down there and that tree fell down there too. You know what? That storm wind blew a whole tree down there. Whole dang thunderstorm storming down there. There's a whole dang tree right there in the wind and the blowing that thing hit the ground down there. I tell you what, it was raining, storm. You should have seen this thing out dang by the beach down there. It was wind blow, whole tree came down. It was just storming and windy and there was the whole by the beach and there was clouds coming through. You should have seen that thing, man. It was down yeah, there. I've seen it. Yeah, man, I'm trying to tell you.